and organization's operations include processes for adding value. Inputs are received from suppliers. Those inputs are transformed in some manner by the operations processes. The result is outputs, which typically go to the customer. Since the outputs are more valuable than the inputs, the transformation process is a value-adding process. Operations management, then, involves planning, organizing, and executing the value-adding processes. For example, a boat manufacturer receives inputs of raw materials such as fiberglass and component parts such as engines. Other essential inputs include labor, machines, and capital. The output is finished boats. The boats are delivered to distributors who eventually sell them to customers. Operations management decisions include deciding what to produce, how to produce it, and when to produce it. Manufacturing operations are a significant portion of many economies. However, most of the economies of developed nations are based in the service sector. In these economies, services represent the majority of the gross domestic product and employment. Banks process customers' money, consultants process clients' information, and fitness centers process customers' bodies and minds.